Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing very well. We've just been told that there is a Bell 47 flyable helicopter in DCS. Free mod, so come and get it. We have got the basic ED forum page here, which I will link in the video description. As well as that, I will link this, which is the download link, in case the ED link changes at any point. Simply come here, click on that, and then download that file. Credits to ARP, UART, and Nibbly lot. Interesting names. Once it's downloaded, you will be presented with the following file. If I go to download, Bell 47B1 in there. Right click on this chap here, copy. Then we're going to go to our saved games area, which for me is C drive, users, my particular user, saved games, DCS open beta, I'm on 2.7 at the moment. And then we're going to go mods, if you don't have that folder in there, make it exactly like that. Then you're going to have aircraft, if you don't have that folder, make that as well please. Right click, paste, that's going to paste the Bell 47 mod in there. Ping, okay, let's just shut everything down. Next, we're going to jump into DCS, which for me is DCS Open Beta, the latest 28 May 2021. We're in now. If it's installed correctly on the modules or mods icons down the bottom, you will have the Bell 47 1.0, which is great. And we've got to set the controls up. So options, controls in here, select the Bell. And we're going to just set the absolute least that you need. The first thing to do is go to access commands here and it will probably have a guess at what you want and it will almost certainly get it wrong so you're going to the various joystick and or rudder pedals columns here we're going to click up here clear all of them and start from scratch then you will want if you've got a spare axis button zoom view you will want cyclic roll and cyclic pitch on your joystick left right and up and down if you've got rudder pedals then you're going to want pedals left and right and you might actually want thinking about it a bit of access tune on those pedals if you've got relatively small travel pedals like me it's quite a nifty little helicopter so you may want to put some access tune on the pitch and roll as well it's up to you collective you're going to set to your you know your normal throttle slash thrust lever there and that's all of the axes we're going to need and then if we start at the bottom weapons you're going to need gunfire and weapon release and view you might want zoom in slow zoom out slow it depends that won't work in vr i guess systems trim down up left and right and you've already got home here as your start button you've already got throttle up and down page up page down and if you want to throttle idle cut off you've got end key here so i'm just going to leave them as they are I have actually got night vision goggles so we can use them there change those buttons if you change those keys if you want and i think that's going to be it crew control are just one for the left seat two for the right seat and request controlling multi-crew of c and that will do us that's okay to that let's go and set a quick mission up in the persian gulf now we're going to go to kasab we've got some baddies up there we're going to place our helicopters via the ad helicopter group there just put them on the wrong way there let's make them usa that's fine let's make them type bell 47 that's fine skill let's make them client let's make their type take off on the ground so that we have to do a cold start let's point them in whatever direction we want to point them let's go to their payload so different paint schemes that we can have it's kind of bugged in here so you can't see, really see it anyway but you've got different uh, paint schemes there payload floats you can have either float on for water floats which aren't working at the moment anyway or turn them off and that reminds me of jaws 2 by the way hook we can have either an agra spray bar which you can sort of see up there which is a you know crop dusting type spray bar that this is used for or a cable or a cargo hook and just for simplicity we'll take that off it gets a little bit confusing at this point but we can have a medic or a medic slot which can be a m60 machine gun or a oh 58d so that's the kiowa browning or stretchers and we'll make that the m60 then we've got the gunner can be a door gunner mini gun and now i don't think that works but we'll have a have a go and see if we can get it to work that's it we're going to turn the fuel down because we don't want it to be super heavy i'm just going to add a couple more then we're going to jump in multiplayer so when we enter a multiplayer server like this you'll be presented with three playable slots per helicopter that's not actually right you can get in the pilot you can get in the instructor pilot as we'll show later you cannot get in the gunner slot at the moment that is ai only so for the time being we'll get in our separate helicopters unpause the server let's have a little look around our 
our chopper. So you can see it's you know it's pretty cool, pretty highly detailed. I, I love this chopper; it's such a beast. Um, now the interesting thing: the engine uh, we believe is actually a 280 horsepower internal combustion engine piston style engine, almost like a kind of car engine. You can see you've got a car type exhaust there, got more car tape intake filter there. Uh, correct us if we're wrong, but that's well, we believe it works. That's really interesting. I don't think how easy maintenance must be for that engine there. I'm so jealous. Uh, we've got a GI there with his M60 or whatever the hell that is on the side. We've got us looking, let's face it, pretty cool with our cravat. How do you feel about that, Simba? It's weirding me out. We haven't even taken off yet, and this gunner's looking all over the place. Yes, Too is. much time in Vietnam for him. Too much time in Vietnam. These are presumably the, the uh, fuel tanks. Yes, pineapples. He looks like the dude from uh, Full Metal Jacket. I guess he does, doesn't he? Animal Mother. That's what I think. That's the one. That's his Animal name. Mother. Roger. <laughs> right. Uh, so that's that. Next, we're going to jump in our cockpit and we're going to do a cold start procedure. Now, that's written down here. Uh, this piece of paper is written down wrong, of course, because it's a mod, but we will figure it out anyway. So, guys, power selector switch up for battery or down for ground power. Well, that's just wrong. It actually needs to go down for battery. So, left click, battery on. Next, hold starter switch home until RPM is at 13%. That's also wrong but i'll show you uh, so we're going to press and hold home rpm is here it'll go up to about six or seven um, it won't go any higher than that okay next once it's up to its six or seven we're going to while holding home just quickly tap end for the idle throttle cut off zap up it goes now hold home until we're up to about 58 percent Okay, done. We can release home now. Now we need to charge the battery with the inverter and the generator. We think that that there turns the generator on. I've got no way of really proving this. It's the best we can do. And that there is the inverter, we believe. Again, it's the best we can do. None of these other switches work. Uh, we've next got increase RPM to 100%. So that's page up until RPM goes up to 100%. So page up. Still high. Down we go, 100%, near enough. Uh, next we've got an awesome looking dash here with um, pretty high def gauges. Everything works here as far as I'm aware, uh, passively. And like I said, a few of the switches work, some of them don't. Oh, what have we got down here? Some lights. We think the down positions are on. It's kind of a bit weird, this helicopter. Also, clear to fire will allow this GI to fire. And we believe clear to fire is in the down position like that. Okay, so that our radios, as far as I'm aware, don't actually do anything. A nice ADI there that's going to work. We can see around the helicopter like this. Hello. So we've not got our crop dusters on, we've not got our floats on, we've not got our, uh, not body bags, what are they called? Stretchers on, but we do have our GI gunner on. So guys, uh, we're going to do some flying now, and at the top left of the screen, you can see cyclic, left and right, cyclic forward and back, collective up and down, uh, pedals uh, left and right. Flying this thing is pretty much an art form. I don't really have any advice for you <laughs> apart from just try and figure it out. It, this is not an easy thing to fly. Okay guys, off we go. Literally almost hits me. That's fine. Don't worry about that. Sorry, I we can try and do yes, that. Roger Pineapples, you're trying to show off, aren't you? Right, here we go. Uh, plenty of left cyclic, I think. Plenty of collective to get it going. 280 horsepower rocking away. Correct with the rudder. I know it's not called a rudder, but you know what I mean. I think I'm in ground effect now. Yes, I'm in ground effect. Okay, so the, the trim definitely helps. So you can fire, guys, with uh, the trigger button. Get some. I apologize if I hit anyone there. Yep, uh, you've got the trim you can do there. I've got big fat wing wings, so I'm not going to use trim, but. For a normal step, definitely trim. Right, let's go down the runway, guys, and let's um, let's go and shoot some baddies. You need lots and lots of trim to fly this thing straight and level valued viewers. Lots of pedal, lots of cyclic trim. God, boys are down there already. How fast have you guys got it? I'm already up to 100 miles an hour nearly. What a beast. Look at the boys nailing it. Are the weapons guided, guys, or is it just literally... Um. So it just fires Two. sideways, yeah? Yeah. Get some. Get some. First one to bag a Ural gets a 
something. <laughs> oh, guess so. I'm at five percent damage. I can't even see where I'm aiming, guys. Oh, with one's move, look. Not the most effective machine gunning in the world, if I'm honest. Hey, say that Guess out. So. Guess so. Guess so. Why the guy just keeps firing, doesn't even run out of ammo. Guess so. I've dodged. Going through. I'm not hitting anything though, but it's all landing in the right place. <laughs> right, I'm giving up a 6%, guys. Right, let's meet back at the parking space and we'll go and try and park these things. The first one to park gets a Diet Coke. We hear some alert. Are you saying I have a weight problem? Yep. I don't want to skirt around the issue. It's going. You don't seem to need any uh, any pedals at all. Mine's kind of flying in a straight line with no pedal right now. Yeah, but... actually, I agree. You get to a certain speed, it kind of trims itself it's out. out yeah. yeah, but that's not to say it's easy to fly. I wouldn't call this an easy to fly vehicle. Uh, we'll land and we'll, we'll go in each other's plane as a little mulch crew, and I think we'll finish off there. Right, who can land without smashing the helicopter up? That guy's got VRS already. Smash! Right. Right, watch this, Valley yeah, viewers. Right, here's where it gets tricky. Oh, 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 here's where it gets tricky. Oh my giddy arm! Help! Yep, they're straight into VRS and smash the, smash the thing to pieces. But I think we can survive. Luckily, no damage, Model Valley viewers, so. Oh, we're over again. I survived. I'm on my... Like a glove. I did not survive. Right, well, I'm going to get in your plane then. Um, because I've had a few minor problems. Looks like I'm not getting the coke. Right, let me in. Mass machine. Have you been drinking, Cap? Yep. Okay, I'm in the left seat. Which seat are you in? I'm in the left seat. Well, I'm in the right seat now. You... I'm guessing you have control, so up you go. Here he goes, ladies and gents. That there is Simba. Flying the vehicle. Get some, baby. Now, annoyingly, I can't be the gunner. I would love nothing more at this point than to go, taka taka, get some, get some. In fact, the gunner's actually disappeared for me, which is interesting. He's not in your lap. You know what? I don't feel very really happy with you driving. You're a bit squiggly for my liking, Simba. I believe C is to request control. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Well, get me some out of you, because I'll only crash it otherwise. I'm gonna request control now with the Charlie button. Oh, I got control. I you got control, control, baby. Right, let's go and do some scenic flying. Let's go and... Me and Simba have been thinking about moving in together. And we're gonna go and look at apartments. Here we go. Don't tell Simba's wife. Or my wife. Yeah. I like the, I like the straight edges on that one. They are, I do like a good straight edge. The way I like to iron my pants. Uh oh. Minor problems, Simba. Minor problems. I can only apologise. Looks like we'll be paying for this one and not moving in because it's burnt. I like my flat. Well done. Okay, valid viewers, I can only apologise for the two damage blocks and about probably 50 to 100 casualties. But we did show off the Bell 47. Uh, anything you think we missed, guys? No. <laughs> That's excellent work. Bye-bye. <laughs>